Hey guys, welcome to my messy desk. Um, this is Beck. Um, I made a little recycling project. It's a catch-all for my desk. And basically, it's going to replace the random buckets and things that I keep on my desk to catch things that, it, that are left over from projects that I'm working on and I just throw them into the bucket and <coughs> they live there until I put them away. Um, the project is still drying so I kind of wanted to show you a couple things before um, the couple things that I used before moving on to the actual project and telling you how I put it together. Um, one thing that I used is the DCWV Royal Garden Stack. Um, this stack is not for everybody, guys. Honestly, um, if my heraldry for Society of Creative Anachronism wasn't peacocks, I would never have bought this stack because it is very peacocky and bright and foiled and just, you know, mostly tacky. <laughs> I love it, though, because my, my heraldry is a peacock in a pride. Um... So I bought this stack to do a uh, a couple mini albums for me and my sister. I just don't have enough pictures yet, and I thought, hey, since I'm going to use this part of the stack anyway, why don't I just go ahead and use some of the papers? I know I'm not going to use for anything else. I'll use some for um, projects. So this is the piece of paper I used. Yeah, it's brightly colored. It's um very shiny photorealistic paper. It's a uh, glare-tastic right this second. Um, it doesn't look real. I mean, the peacock looks so over-colored that it's ridiculous, but if you just take the, the peacock feathers, it works fine. So, I used that paper. I used acrylic medium black gesso. Now, I've heard this word be pronounced two different ways. I've heard it be called gesso and gesso. I don't know the pro the uh, correct pronunciation of that word, but when I was in elementary school, the G made the G sound, so I call it gesso. If that's wrong, oops, my bad. Um, I also used Folk Art Outdoor Metallics in Blue Sapphire. Um, Deco Art Dazzling Metallics and Medieval Gold and Deco Art One Step Crackle. Moving on to the project. All right, let me show you this side so I can show you what I did with the paint. First, I've used the gesso, and I only have black gesso right now. I have black and gray, and gray is really depressing, so I don't use the gray very often. I use the black. So um, I guessed everything first, and then I applied a layer of the. Uh, the medieval gold metallic and then I did let that dry and then I did another layer of um, the sapphire the blue sapphire color and then I applied the get the uh, gesso no I didn't I applied the crackle after that and then let that dry for a full day to get that nifty little crackled effect kind of looks like alligator skin only prettier Really glare-tastic, but, you know, kind of fun. Anyway, that's how I painted it. Oh, I should have, I should mention that this is a book cover. Um, I had a book that was falling apart, so I figured um, I'd recycle it and use the papers and uh, use the paper for other things and then use the book cover for this. So I took the book cover and I painted that, and that's what I used for that. And I built the size out of the paper, out of the scrapbook paper from the stack. I also put a piece of cardboard in the bottom and I sort of covered the inside just to make it look like I tried but really I didn't honestly care about that so I didn't spend a whole lot of time doing that that's really not um, I don't really care about the inside it's gonna catch paint and all kinds of other stuff so I didn't really care anyway I thought it was really cool that you know there was embossing on the on the book cover that was, doubt you can see that, but it was an elephant with wings, which I thought was kind of nifty, so I left that, that part uncovered. 
on the front. And then this little doodad here is actually a piece of the cake box card box thing. I made a cake box, or I made a cake that looked, her blah, I can't speak, I swear. I made a box that looked like a cake for my brother's wedding. And I decided that since it was in such terrible shape that I was going to recycle all the, the, the pretties off of it and, and reuse them. Because I'm broke, so reusing things is awesome. Anyway, this is the piece that I used on the middle portion of the cake. And um, I just tore it off there. Tore off any of the leaves that, that looked terrible. And then I took the, the uh, medieval gold paint. And I painted each of the flowers, which probably would have been a whole lot simpler if this was already, if these were brand new and I was just taking them out of the box <clears throat> to paint those flowers. It would have been a whole lot easier. They were already glued together, so I had to paint them from that. They're not dry onto the, onto my box yet, so I'm kind of trying to be careful with it. Um, well, the paint's dry, but the glue that's holding it onto it isn't dry. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, the leaves I then tipped in uh, the medieval gold. And this little bit right here is a Marion Smith vintage trinket. Anyway, that's the little catch-all for my desk. And that's how it sits. And that's it. That's, that's what I've done over the past two days. Instead of doing the projects I said I was going to do. <laughs> um, hopefully I'll get those done this weekend. And get you like, guys some videos up on the, the altered uh, hot, hot pink crate and maybe even the uh, the picture frame that I like the shape, but I didn't like the color. Um, anyway, that's what I've done. Uh, projects are pretty much on me right now because Key is moving and she doesn't have her craft room together yet, but she is doing a couple of videos on um, storage and things like that that we picked up and learned from other people and I will probably be implementing in in my uh, craft room when it finally gets here um, still jumping through circus poodle hoops for that but anyway that's it that's this project and now it's like 3 a.m. and I'm, I'm going to bed now promise have a great night guys and I'll see you next time Again, this is Beck, and this is definitely a messy desk.